pleasure today of speaking with Dr. Gail Grabowski, who is the Director of the Environmental Studies Program at Chaminade University. Thank you for joining us. Oh, my pleasure, Lila. Thank you for having you me. You must be in heaven being outside here. Oh, yeah. I, I think it's the best place to run an environmental studies program on the planet. <laughs> I mean, I tell the students sometimes, how many places are there where you can be in the mountains doing a mountain hike in a rainy place right in 15 minutes and also be on the reef in 15 minutes, you know? So, yeah, it's amazing. And from your perspective with environmental studies, mm -hmm. um, it must be really, mm, I would say, heartwarming when, when a lot of our Polynesian students come to Chaminade. Oh, yeah. And the uh, environmental studies program is 28% Hawaiian students. And I think we're 45% Pacific Islanders, so students from Oceania. And they bring, of course, this sort of natural love and respect for nature, you know, this whole term malama and the idea of pono, you know, making, making our relationship with nature balanced, that's innate in them. So it is a real treat and they get to know the students from the mainland. So there's real cross fertilization of ideas. For example, if we're talking about the coral reef or fish, I have asked my class, is there anyone in here who never buys the fish that they eat and hands go up? <laughs> so if you're a student from New York and you see that, you're like, whoa, you know, we're used to fish sticks. Oh, yeah. And so we can use all of that to talk about sustainable use of the natural resource. And in one of my classes now, we're learning uh, how to throw net and we're learning hmm. about how that's done properly and how, why that was a sustainable practice because the nets can't catch everything. And, you know, it's, it's just wonderful to see them learning from each other. And we talk, because it's environmental studies, we talk a lot about the values, the underlying reasons why, I don't even want to say nature matters, but just why our relationship with the earth is so important to our well-being with everything from water, we need clean water, to the beauty. You know, I went swimming this morning and saw the, the white terns flying, the Manu Oku, and saw little kids in summer camp going out in the water. And I thought the importance of the clean water and mm -hmm. this little bird that was threatened for a while, you know, and then we look at the values underlying that. Why does that matter to us? And it's everything from your basic health to your sort of psychological well-being. Because we're environmental studies, we have students with all different sort of mm. natural talents. Like some are science oriented, but some are very artistic. Some are big idea people and some are, want that career and want to know what exactly is the, are the careers in say renewable energy. Um, and so there's a challenge there in being sure that we serve them all. So I try to help them realize where the careers are, not just in terms of the different kinds of agencies from businesses right. to government orgs, to NGOs, to law firms, to being a teacher, to being a, something like you do. <laughs> this, you could be an environmental person who's wanting to educate about the, the planet. And so the, it's a challenge to make sure that we have the breadth to, to teach them, show them where all the jobs are, but have them find too, what's for me. Yeah, and I love what you say about finding what's for them, you yes. know, because the breadth of environmental studies is mountain to ocean. Oh yeah, <laughs> yes. Things like some of them are sort of gentle people and they don't want to make waves. They don't want to be policy makers who are in the mix. Some of them want to be policy makers and want to make change. Others of them just want to you know, educate children or do some science or measure water quality. So it really does run the gamut of their expectations in terms of the kind of skills they'll do and the, I don't want to say the stakeholders they serve, but the, the meaningfulness right. their career right. will create. Yeah. Wonderful. Well, yeah. well, your enthusiasm is contagious. And oh. I know there's someone listening who says, I want to do that. Oh, yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being with us. Sure, Lila. Thank you. We've had an energetic meeting with Dr. Gail Grabowski, who is the Program Director for Environmental Studies at Chaminade University. Thank you.